In this training, we have divided the different topics into multiple different lessons. First of all, we're going to cover the security management big picture, talking about different customer challenges we are seeing out there with our customers, as well as the fundamentals of our next generation security management solution that are addressing those challenges. Next lesson is going to cover the R80 security management installation procedure as well as the architecture or an introduction to the architecture. Following that, we're going to cover an introduction to the unified management console called Smart Console, where you're controlling all the different aspects of your security state using the next generation security management solution. Continuing, we're going to dive into each and every section within the management server and the unified smart console. First off, we're going to talk about the R80 unified access control policy as well as some operational efficiency. Following that, we're going to talk about the R80 threat prevention policy that nowadays have been unified. So all different aspects of threat prevention is configured in one single place. Continuing, we're going to talk about orchestration and automation using the security management API provided as a REST-based API in R80. R80 also contains integrated logs, monitoring, and reporting, and that's going to be the next section we're going to cover. As you're probably aware of, R80 contains a multi-domain options as well. So we're going to talk about the R80 multi-domain solution how you work with that, and the different possibilities we have with that solution. In the migration lesson, we're going to talk about how to migrate from previous versions into an R80 security management server. And in the end, we're going to summarize everything with how to demonstrate R80 and what are the different demonstration options we have and how you can conduct a workshop for customers as well as partners. In this training, we have included hands-on labs to give you more hands-on experience with R8 security management. Those virtual machines are available as blueprints inside the Ravel Cloud. So if you go to cloud.ravelosystems.com and log in with your checkpoint credentials, you'll get access to the R8 security management blueprint. If you don't have access to that, please contact me and I'll give you access. If partners would like to get the possibility to utilize these virtual machines inside the cloud, a local contact can execute a local R80 security management trainings for you and provide access to those virtual machines using the Ravel training server. If that has, has questions on how to do that, don't hesitate to contact me. Inside the blueprint, we basically have three R80 security management servers. Two of them is built into a multi-domain security management solution with a primary and a secondary multi-domain server. We have a standalone R80 security management server populated with objects and logs. This server also manages a R77.30 gateway, allowing us to push a policy to that gateway and do different configuration changes. In this blueprint, we also have an R77.30 security management server, allowing us to export the database and do migration import labs into R80 security management solutions. Without further ado, let's continue with the next lesson. Thanks.